Many home sellers make these consistent mistakes when selling their home, which makes them miss out on thousands of dollars or even ten thousands of dollars. Today, I'll be discussing three common mistakes home sellers do when listing their home. Make sure you stick around to the end of this video to learn more. If you're new to the channel, my name is John Cater. I'm a real estate agent at Remax West Experts, servicing the greater Toronto area. So let's get this video started. On to the first point is using poor photos. When it comes to selling your home, photos are a crucial aspect as 99% of the time, potential buyers will be viewing your listing online before they see it in person. If a home listing has pictures that have been taken off a smartphone or even a screenshot from Google Maps, this will limit the exposure of your listing. I've seen listings with only one picture from Google Maps, which does not make it look attractive. It's important that your agent hires a professional photographer to take the photos and have them edited. I always tell my clients that we want to create a good first impression to any potential buyer, whether it's online or in person. The second mistake is something sellers should take very seriously, which is mispricing your home. Overpricing or underpricing can make you lose thousands or even tens of thousands of dollars when listing your home. It's very important to price your property right. A common mistake home sellers do is overpricing their home. I understand there is an emotional attachment, but when overpricing your home, it will most likely stay in the market longer. When looking at the data, there is a direct correlation between days on market and the purchase price. It's common to see homes that are overpriced to stay in the market longer, which does not look good. Eventually, you will need to do a price reduction until you find the right buyer. Homes are the most attractive when it's the first day on the market. If the home is priced right, the listing will get a lot of exposure, which will result in selling quicker. On to the last point, which is not preparing your home. Buyers tend to look for a home that is updated and moving ready. If your home needs work, I highly advise to get them sorted out. Buyers will pay a thorough inspection. Once the inspection is completed, the buyer will see what the property needs to be worked on and will renegotiate with the seller if needed, which can affect the purchase price, causing the seller to lose money. It's important to invest in your home and fix the little things. I tell my clients, we want to minimize the buyers things that need work lists. A few simple updates to your home that can drastically make it look better are painting your walls to a lighter color, installing brighter lights, and if you have carpet, either clean them or replace them. If you made it this far, I want to thank you for watching my video. If you found it useful, make sure you hit that like button. If you plan on selling your home or have any questions about selling your home, feel free to contact me. My contact information is in the description box below. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you guys in the next video.